All right, so we're checking out the only game that forces you to listen to the menu music no matter what you do. It's Bus Driver Simulator 19. It also continues to just add more words to get a simulator. I, I'm, I'm like 99.9% .9 sure there was a bus simulator. That name was taken, so you throw driver in it, and you're set. I do have to mention, what is, what is with like this 1996 Dreamcast music in the background? I feel like this is gonna end up getting claimed by some composer from like Virtua Cop. Is anyone watching this? know what virtual cop is anyway in this game you get to experience life as a bus driver however it's powered by unity so i'm gonna try and shoot a bus into orbit because i'm pretty sure that that's how unity physics works as it applies to simulators at this point might as well do it in career mode we're going to russia folks also i guess you can get like tickets and crash and stuff so i don't know if we're legitimately going to be making any money a lot of different buses here a lot of different buses you have the uh the trendy modern bus you have the floral print bus never mind they're all locked because we ain't got the cash we're going for modern so as an american guy playing this game uh we're going from here to here welcome to rut this guy stopping at a red light, or I just watched a vehicle stop on a dime. Wow, they got some freaking kick-ass brakes over in Russia. Anyway, this is our sweet bus. You'll notice. We'll go ahead and turn it on over here. We already have some uh, unwitting scumbags that are hanging out on the side. Now, if you want to go deep inside of the bus, you can. This is what it's like to uh, exist in Gray's world for about four minutes before he ends up shooting the bus through a building. All right, first question. Can you hit people? Very curious. Yep. Well, actually, no. I don't think you can. I feel... Is there a person inside the bus? <laughs> oh, my God. I can't stop this from happening. Hold on. I got to back up, people. Just give me give me one second. I, nope. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not able to move the bus anymore. The bus is legitimately stuck at this... What the hell? Is this guy drunk? You you can't get on the bus drunk. Who are you? Are you supposed to help me? And why does this lady look so depressed? Is it just because I'm the one driving? Okay, I have at least two bodies deep inside of the bus. You can see that right where my sack area would be, we have at least one drunken Russian guy whose bulbous melon head is sitting right next to my steering wheel. And then we have this nice lady. You can only see her ankles because the rest of her body is inside of the engine block. Yeah, come on in everyone. No big deal, right? I've, I've accumulated about 8,000 uh, Russian money of fines at this point. I thought the guy in the yellow was supposed to be helping me, but I don't think he is. Wow, no one's gonna let this lady have a seat. <laughs> Just gonna make her stand with a bunch of gentlemen. All right, we're set. I've got us going now. So you're gonna notice in the background here, we have, this guy's already face palming. He's like, Jesus, I should have just stayed home drinking. Am I inside of this lady's groin right now? Because I see part of her pelvis and her hand, ah, uh, and it's slowly kind of thrusting. <laughs> got two face palmers. So can I stop here and get like more people or is this the thing? Am I allowed to just keep driving with the door open like this? Does anyone care? What, uh, what's going on with the animations over here? At first, I thought that dude was doing like a half dab, but it looks like he's talking on the non-existent cell phone. Every once in a while, he has a stroke and he stops, but sometimes the animations kick in. Everyone else's animations, not kicking in. This lady over here, kind of doing curls, but not really. I don't know. She's got like the bro stance on. Grandma is the most depressed woman I've ever seen inside of a simulator. Her head is slumped so far that I don't know if she's going to be here when I get back because she may jump in front of the bus. Anyway, so what happens when you hit a car? <laughs> Absolutely nothing. <laughs> How about when you hit the safety bar? Can you go through those? Nope. Now, normally you would wait for traffic, but honestly, we're, we're behind schedule and everyone else will stop. Okay, they will s What the hell? Okay, don't worry. Tokyo Drift Master is here, no big deal. I'm sure that's pretty realistic in these buses. Now, what you want to do is if you can go between all of the, all the vehicles, you get extra points. I'm pretty sure that's the police. They don't appear to care. What the hell is happening to that vehicle? We've shot it out of the dimension. It's in like some sort of cross dimension. It disappeared. It just flat out disappeared. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh, we're rolling now. I've got this down pat. As long as the road is straight, everything's gonna be fine. 
All right, just kind of throw it in the park over here. Open the old door while we're in motion like it's no big deal. So if I'm still in motion, does no one want to get on? Is everyone living in fear too much? Hey, guy on the right, ZZ Top, you getting on? All right, just taking a look at the eclectic group of scumbags on here. I feel kind of weird about that lady second from the front, the girl with the dark hair. It almost looks like she's about to hurl. If she does hurl, it's probably going to splash all over this lady's ass in the blue striped shirt. Do you want on the bus or are you just following me? All right, it's getting kind of packed on here, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I think I'm just gonna leave the doors open because no one really seems to care that much. Here's a cabin light for you guys. Should help you out. What happens if you hit the police? Do they care? <laughs> oh no. Yeah, simply, if you notice in the side view mirror, simply tapping another car removes them from the map. I, I'm, I'm not colliding with any other cars. There's, there's no other car collisions happening right now. Stop it. I'm not hitting another car. There's no other cars around. Okay, you know what? There. there. <laughs> Here's your car collision. I just got the achievement troublemaker. I'm glad they were thinking about me when they made this game. Oh, it's the hospital, I think. I should probably make a stop there because most of the people in here probably have like spine issues now. <sighs> a lot of drunk people in this town. Like this guy, is he wearing armor? Guy wearing Lamler armor? Are you a LARPer, sir? Or he's like dancing too. It was kind of, he kind of like danced a jig onto the bus. This girl's doing the model walk out in the distance. Where did they get these animations from? So if you notice, there is a um, dynamic day and night cycle. It's not just the world slowly shunning me and turning off the sun. Uh, I guess this is intentional. Red light. Pfft. Are the trees growing in the... Yeah, they're definitely growing. Oh, hold on. Uh. All right, ladies and gentlemen, step right up. There's plenty of... There's plenty of vomit-filled seats to go. That lady is the most wasted woman I've seen on the bus yet. She is moonwalking away. She just ran into that pole. Just straight up ran into the pole. I'm gonna try and hit some people again just to see what happens. Uh-huh. We have a, a female senator getting on. She's also about six foot four, so not gonna mess with her. Can anyone tell me what's wrong with the woman with the brown hair and the red pants? He's missing a freaking cell phone. I don't know what's going on over here, but I'm pretty sure wherever this guy's hand is like phasing into, this is some sort of a legal battery. It's really disconcerting watching as the trees bloom into being down the roadway. This is with uh, graphics on maximum. I'm telling you, I don't know if this old lady is a zombie or if she's just really depressed. This lady's trying to console this dude. She's like, don't worry, sir. Gray will make sure it's all over soon. I shouldn't feel this bad, but I feel like the fact that I can't smash into the pedestrians is really taking a lot out of the game. Why does no one have a cell phone in any bus simulation game? They're willing to put gauntlets on this guy going to the D&D convention, but they won't give everyone else a cell phone. Hold on, madam. I'll put you out of your misery. Oh, invisible wall. Never mind. So if I drive on the wrong side of the road, Will you guys get into the car? Will you get into the bus or? All right, I think I screwed up kind of bad. I'm having a little bit of a tough time going over the, damn it. I was gonna say going over the curb. Let me just slowly fuse the bus with the old lady's body. I just noticed there's a lot of arms hanging outside of the glass. I don't think that this is anything I did. I, I think it's just the nature of the beast. Please don't get off the bus while the bus is in motion. Please don't get off the bus while the bus is in motion. All right, go ahead, violate all the safety rules. I mean, I guess who am I to talk, but route completed. Money earned. Zero. Mm. So, um, I ran into the police over here. However, his eyeliner was so thick that he couldn't see who did it. I attempted to uh, come back into the main screen just to maybe uh, give everything another shot. Maybe we could uh, score some money, a little bit of Russian cash, so that we could get that one lady some antidepressants or something. Uh, that's not happening. Nothing's clickable anymore. Alrighty. Well, everyone, that's uh, Bus Driver Simulator 19. I'm sure this is the most accurate representation of bus driving that has ever been translated into digital media. I think I'm ready to start putting people's lives in my hands. Anyway, folks, until next time, Stay foxy and much love.